up against the ferryman. We'll throw it to the casters, Gore and Trelly. Thanks. And they've got a he little bit of dash from Variety, what? but like you said, he goes in, and that's gonna be the damage. Sino takes him out, gets the blue buff, and it's first blood for the ferryman. Fight over the shield buff. It's gonna be successful oh for the Kings. Goodness. Oh my god, the damage onto hardcore. You just need a little bit more, and that's gonna be the fire bolts from Paul locking it down. And they aren't done yet. Sino wants a little more. Again, taunt. Looks like Variety will be getting chased uh -oh. down here. Does have the beads, uses it the slow. Not good oh enough. Sino confirms that kill. And the Camelot Kings knew there were two over. They they grouped up towards gold, but they didn't feel confident going in for it, so that's gonna be. At the rate he's been farming in the next few minutes, we'll see though if they make it there. Twig, level he's 14 silenced. just deleted in the mid lane. Quig has to try and retreat, does use the ult, and that's gonna give the distance. From answer, can't even grab that. Well, they're going for Baskin right now, but this isn't working out for him. Oh no, Sino! He does it again, takes care of Twig, and Variety does not have a lot of room to work with. Beads from Sino, shot from Baskin. Sino might be in a little bit of trouble. Might have some help, though. Good shot. Is at least able to get enough, but that's a kill. Oh, he's clutch. For the Kings, Baskin over the wall finds Twig in response, but they need a little more to make that worthwhile with how ahead you had for Sino. Tings has all. Now at 50%. Now it's going to be going. Tings, like you said, has ult back up, but that's not the goal for the Ferryman. They're going to go in. They're just going to kill off one, kill Girl. off two. It's Twig. It's hardcore, and they are gone in the blink of an eye variety. Half health already, and the chase is on. Paul, Sino, Cyclone, they're just looking for the CC. They've got the slow. They've got the damage, and they've got exactly what they need. Killing spree for Paul at 3-0-1, oh, and, and of course... That has not slowed the chase down. A lot to work with. Variety already low. Quig as well, taking a lot of poke. They're going to go for their ults, try to create some space. Fear No Evil dropped to the back, but it's not going to be able to find too much. Sino goes in too deep, though. And that is finally a second kill for the Kings and a good defense. But it only Into goes so far. Oh my god, Cyclone with a great weave. He only locks down two. Quig goes in, maybe too deep. A couple more autos, and the shot's going to be there. Cyclone spin with the kill. The Phoenix Kings, as best they can, Ferryman are going to isolate one, cut him down, and that's Quig who's gone. Now, it's next on the chopping block. Maybe nobody. The Kings playing in the Titan room, Ferryman. Titan's going to be the target here. The old oh, Honda man. Quig, he almost dies on impact. Luckily, makes it into the fountain, so he stays alive there. Tycho drums on to Paul. It seems like that's the goal. That's the target. Hardcore leaps in once the damage, but you just can't lock him down. Healing keeps Paul going. Half health variety, barely makes it back to the fountain. Same thing for Twig. Unfortunately for them, while their health is good, the Titan falls anyway, and the fairy Yamoja Yemoja, and Erlong top three. Look good if they want to even out the set. We'll throw it over to the casters. Thank you. Yarkor, not into a great spot, though. But here comes Twig with the gang. The double whoop out of the damage, but they've got plenty to try to chase this down. It gives him a little bit of wiggle room. Cyclone, good jukes, but does eventually get met with his own demise. Hardcore finds the shot. Quig is low, and Sino wants to turn it around, is able to find it, does exactly what he needs. Now are you in a bad spot? Good stun from Twig, keeping things engaged. Aurora's going to be the target. Hardcore's got the shots. Good stun from Aurora, and you got a little bit. The whoop is great, but the rat is greater. Finds that one. Sino again looking to balance things out. He picks up two, loses his duo lane. And what a kerfuffle it feels like over here. But now Cyclone, oh my god, he's been able to respawn and get back in here. And Twig appropriately darts his way on out. Coming from Cyclone, cleanup kill from Aurora. And the reverse rebuke locks down onto Quig. You've got Sino coming Body in to box. help as well. You're going to blink over the wall. You get one more shot, kill off the support. The chase down is there from the jungler. Forces the ult out of hardcore. Puts him under the tier one, two clean kills. A little bit of a rotation, like you said. Baskin actually comes in, Boulder, Boulder over the wall. <laughs> They've got the damage and they get Quig before he can get into the air. Baskin, chase down onto hardcore. Stun comes out from Cyclone, push back. You're gonna be there, but he's gonna wait out the beads. And beautifully timed, hardcore goes into the ult. And again, just making sure that they can keep things going their way. Ult from Sino, burn is there. You need a couple more hits from somebody. And it's going to be Cyclone who ends up finding him. Do trade out. Twig comes in. Massive kill for him. He's going to be dancing under the tier one, trying his best to stay alive. They get rid of Sino. They lose a couple. Even goes in. Has a lot of damage. Twig is low. Sino might be able to do anything, but no, the 2v1. Oh, there's just nothing you can do about it. The damage for the Kings. Too strong. They tie up the kills. 
In fact, they even take the gold lead for the first time this game. I mean, yeah, Captain. Right now, Beacon controlled halfway all the way there for the Ferryman. Engage onto Sino. Sino's taking a lot of poke. Double dash, but he goes back to his team. He's just distracting right now. Couple more shots from Hardcore. It's going to be Tings. Gets got on. Oh, Seems beautiful to be pull. just fine. Goes into the ult. And again, like you said, a beautiful pull from Baskin. Damage is there, and Tings is gone. Great engage from the Ferryman. And then the lockdown. Reverse Rebuke forces an ult out of Twig. Goes in for a double knockup on the Sino and Baskin, but the push is good. The CC, the damage, not quite there. Forces out the ult from Hardcore, but it's still playing aggressive. You've got a massive, That'd be massive quick. talent pool over here. And yeah, you got to kill somebody. I think Quig kind of recognizes there's not any getting out of that one. Body blocked against the wall, killed off. Trelly, this one, compared to last game, in some time, but the autos are there. You need one more hit. Sino goes for it under the tower, might lose his life for it. Shield pays off in dividends. You've got four more kings over here. What a rotation Blink's got from Blink. the Chaos team. Blink the blink. blink for one. Sino's low. This is going to be a kill. Ferryman, pull this. We're going to listen in with the kings, see how they take the fight. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm ulting, I'm ulting, I'm ulting. Can you go here? Can you go here? Yeah, I'm taunting them. I'm taunting them. I'm on Neath. I'm on Neath. Yeah, I'm on Neath. Yeah, I'm on Neath. Yeah, I'm on Neath. I've got no mana, guys. I'm back here. Oh, yeah, shit. I'm getting shits on. I can her. I can her. Yeah. Yeah. Do you go for the steal if you're Paul? He's still hanging around. You don't hang this close to the FG unless you're going for something good. Whoop from Hardcore. He gets it! And he gets it! Oh kill. my god, he gets that in! He gets a kill! He might go for a double here! One more auto's all he needs! Won't be able to find it. World Weaver will be taken by Variety. So they only get the one kill, but you get the FG on two. Aurora kills him anyway! <laughs> Aurora shows up! Oh no! There's oh. no way! Saves me from having to think about what just happened. And instead goes for the knockup. Cyclone spins the target. Cyclone spin is an easy one to find. Gets rid of him, no problem. But Sino, Sino's back in this game, and he wants you to know it. Takes out Tings to make sure that one goes one for one. He's low. And it will be traded out, Twig. Pyromancer, pretty simple pickup. Maybe a roar will be two. You've got five Kings, one Yamoja. And look, the math adds up on that one. Kings find that kill pretty simply. Luckily, again, for the Ferryman. Split Cyclone, no World Weaver. Variety's gonna make it back to base. They need to find a kill. They need to find their presence somewhere else. Rivers Rebuke comes up, separates the fight. Twig versus Spin on the side. And you're getting damage going both ways, but luckily Cyclone Spin has a little bit more help. Twig goes in alone. Get the Tycho drums immediately from Variety. He's low. Boulder connects. Rivers Rebuke just a little bit late there, and the beads actually work in wonders Dicks. here, but it's not enough. Tings gets the lead of Variety. No way does he come back into this. It could be an easy kill. Twig looking for one of his own, but Sino going to be just fine. No matter how things go. World Weaver catches out the dash, but Variety maintains it, is able to find it. Quig is the target. Beautiful up, push. And the damage is good. One more hit, and that's one more kill for the Ferryman. Now, Trelly, looking at this, 60 seconds, full minute. You get Tings back. Hardcore. A little bit, misses the whoop, goes for some damage, aiming for Cyclone, now spotted out, Valkyrie's discretion, shots are good, but it's not going to find the kill, instead, you have to land, that might end up causing his demise, you get one, He's you lose alive? things, the autos, the damage, the bubble bounce from Aurora, finally, shuts that one down after losing your own carry, but it is kills, 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 for the ferryman, they have gotten almost the full wipe twist, kind they're of just diving the Cyclone, conversation. they're going for Cyclone, I don't I don't know if it's the right call, but they're looking for it. There's going to be Twig, and he finds the kill on the variety anyway. Goes one for one, and meanwhile, the rest of the Kings aren't winning their own fight. Sino gets taken down by Hardcore, so you keep it. Twig in an isolated area, just yes, around Blake. the corner, dodges out the L, and is able to get away for a little bit, but not away from Baskin's waiting arms. Now, Paul goes in. You have to be careful here. Quig is going to be enough to find that kill, Trelly. So many deaths in this one. Only three left standing. Paul, no ultimate, gets taunted back in. The beat's already down, and here comes Twig. Has the stun, immediately goes for the damage onto the Baba Yaga, and that's where Variety it comes in. Tycho drums, damage is good, and they've got the lockdown. Get rid of the mid laner, and finally put him down. Unfortunately, you've lost your own in the process. One, six, and nine for big man. This give, was a third pick, Neath. He's like, dude, give me any hunter that can do crit. Please, we need to go in. Quig, once again, do they have the damage to burst him? No, they're going to give up on it, but Captain Twig goes to the back line anyways. Relatively deep. Does he get out? And the answer so far is yes. Beads down towards the World Weaver. Titan, full HP, running down left lane. Tier 2, Phoenix end. That's got to be on the mind of the Styx Ferryman. 
But Yarkor is going to be back up in 20 seconds. Can the Camelot Kings hold out? FG enhanced. This should be a pretty simple Phoenix. Maybe you can go for a kill, knock up onto Variety, but again, the wall saves his life. But it only saves it maybe for a little bit. Dash gets him back to the Fountain. Hardcore back in five. But the Titan is the goal. And it looks like that's going to be all they need. Ferryman in 49-35 are able to find this. Those kills despite not having that. Three backs up against the wall. The Kings have to push us if they want to stay alive in this set. The damage come through to kill him. Kenny ult out. Doesn't seem like it. I think Aurora's going down. Yeah, that's cut and dry. Body block CC. Uh, but more importantly, what you highlighted, damage from Twig and from the net worth. So he's 51. Ooh, oh, oh, he's so at the bottom. Oh, it's 1100. Oh it's just Baskin. God. Gore, it's just Baskin. It's only Baskin. Baskin is the lead. <laughs> and Variety's under tier two. Yeah. This is not unlucky. I'm this gonna... is this is Variety did it to himself for sure. Lil, maybe Lil Goofy. Goes for the Ox Worm, so now they know the bird's not going to be there. You've got three collapsing in on you. Knock up, damage. And then before the Somersault Cloud can come out, Baskin gets the last auto. Well, he goes forward, and yeah, he's got so many surrounding him. Oh my god, the damage from Sino. It's more than I would expect, and it's just enough to get the job done. Variety goes in. A little bit of damage from Baskin. Taunt. Bird form taunt good, and that's going to be enough to lock him down. The Ferryman, four to one, read the kills. The variety, we know three minutes ago, you can't feel safe under the tier two. Has to play it safe here. Cyclone, finally, someone goes on him. And finally, they're able to get the kill. There's no help from anybody else on the ferryman. And Trelly, they shut down early this time. God. Now there's level 14 Ryzen, and I think Big Man Tinks is going to be in some big trouble. Here comes the Tycho Drums. Yeah, and with that taunt, man, the damage is there. It's just an argument for who gets the last hit in basket. Now to gold. The one to find it with the Tycho Drums. To try and defend the purple buff as well. Here comes Paul and Aurora. If anything, they might go in. Yeah, World Weaver on the hardcore. There's going to be the dazzling offensive, looking for some stuns. You've got Aurora now coming down. Taunt on to two. It's Twig and hardcore pulled in, and the damage is there. It's coming from the Morgan Le Fay. It's coming from the Neath, and they've got two clean kills from the Ferryman. They might be able to find a little more. Paul looks for some damage. Variety's rotated in. Knockup's going to be good. They might end up having to pay a little bit more, but the taunt still solid from Aurora to keep things going. Tings taken down. Variety left to the Hounds. Oxworm. As much as they can. Backflip in for Cyclone. Here comes the taunt from Aurora. Captain Twig already beats uh -oh. the bit of go. You got World Reaver if you want to try and catch out the Ming form, but not sure it's going to be necessary. Paul should be able to clean that one up. And now next oh, time, man. and guess what? Sino was waiting. And Captain Twig's not even going to cancel his back. He was right there. And he said, good luck, bro. I'm going back to base. <laughs> when your jungler is just sitting around the wall watching you die and goes, the issue is, oh, they're going to 1v1. Cyclone is actually going for it with the Yarkor over in left lane. But no, it's never a 1v1. Not when Aurora is here. Unfortunate for Yark. Cannot find it. The defender of Olympus Twig also oh, falls down. Yeah, I'm going to Fire Giant to answer your question. I'm I'm already there if I'm the Styx Ferryman. But can they even kill him here is the question. Silence out the bird form doesn't need to. And now your core forced ult away. Baskin is caught underneath the tower. There's some good damage coming his way, but his health bar's not dropping as much as you'd think. Yeah, River's Rebuke keeps him in control. Damage onto Tings is more than enough. Onto Quig, double for Cyclone. The Ferryman on the Titan as they speak to to defend. And that's all the Kings have. Twig tries his best. Spread some damage out there. The tank Titan's going to be tanky. Oh, unfortunately five. for Twig, that's not going to happen. Can you save it enough for Variety? Hardcore is going to go back to the fountain. Variety shows up. Maybe low health bar is enough. Diamond is up. He, he could ult, but he's going to bring the team north. He's going to bring them away from the squad. Didn't end up using the ult. Didn't, Didn't want have to. the opportunity. <laughs> Did not want to. Taunt comes through. There's the ultimate. Maybe the first end call was a little much. You got the numbers advantage. Chase down on the twig. Ignore the Phoenix. Go for the kill. And they do exactly that. Ferryman with two off the board. Maybe looking for three. Putting up one more kill on the hardcore. Baskin goes in. Unable to lock it down. Forces the ult. And they're going to go for it. Goose eggs for three of the players on the Ferryman and the Titan. It's the goal, hardcore, taken down instantly. Tight, half health, gets reset, goes back up to 3-4. Sino, low, here, doesn't go for the taunt onto Variety. You're fighting a 4v5. Hardcore's back in 20. Titan taking damage, and it looks like this one might just be the charm. Sino's getting low, but will he go down? The answer is no, 
and the ferryman in a three. Three targets that needed to die, and those.